having those conversations early on where you say, okay, so let's attribute some piece of value to the idea, okay, and that's kind of the base. But then on top of that, how are we going to attribute value in terms of who's putting time into the business? Do we attribute value to time? Who's creating intellectual property? And sometimes you don't realize that until it's been created. So for example, with Now Account, we started the business and not too far into it, one of our partners identified a program that we were able to leverage to really start to scale the business, to access capital. And when that program came up, we actually all sat down and said, wait a minute, this person doesn't spend as much time day to day with us, but this program that they brought to the table is going to have a huge impact on the valuation of the company. So how do we think about that now? How do we attribute some value to that? Do we give them additional shares for that? Anytime you see a unit of value being created, you should stop and talk about it. Even if you decide not to attribute value to it at that time. But if you don't talk about it, then what happens is that person thinks, well, I've added all this value. Nobody's recognizing it. And then a year later, when you now know what the answer is, was it valuable or not? There's friction, right? Because they're saying, well, I brought this to the table and you didn't give me anything for that. Well, at the time, we didn't know it was valuable. <laughs> but having those conversations early on and allocating value at the point that you see the potential for it, I found has a leaves room for a lot less arguments later.